Okay guys, today we're here with Dean Lister, huge pleasure to have him on my channel. <laughs> and uh, guys, we're gonna go over here uh, about the Omoplata Escape. He told me he has a very cool Omoplata Escape. And uh, many times we feel uh, grapplers fighting and when they got an Omoplata they feel completely lost. So let's see here what Dean Lister has to show. Well, <laughs> well thank you for having me brother. Uh, the, the thing is, um, you know, people say, oh, Plata, should I roll, should I do this? And, uh, of course, there's many options, okay? But these things, especially him, but, you know, advanced grapplers have seen these things, right? So we'll look at a few things and why I don't suggest them, and I'll show you my preferred way. However, realize different things work different for different people, right? So there's no best way is the best way for you, okay? Vamos começar? Yeah. Of course, I know he has a great one, Plata, right? I'll use my arm here. Now, it's strange, but all I do is I grab the ins by my knee, okay? If I grab my belt, it's gonna go easy, okay? If I grab by my high thigh, if I grab here, it's not good. I grab right here by my knee, okay? And don't, so put a little pre pressure, pressure, right? Now, be careful about um, doing this with your arm because he's gonna straight get that submission, okay? Be careful about that. Your elbow's in, okay? Now, I can sit on my, on my, the pressure, pressure. I can hold this kind of well. And what's interesting is I can actually pass the leg by. It works on high level people, okay? He, I'm sure you've seen this escape. Was that Jean yeah, yeah, I see. So, so he'll know it's coming, but almost no one sees this coming. And I pass their guard. I get three points, okay? It's an example of a counter, not a block or an escape. I am escaping, okay? But it's uh, one of those situations where you can practice it and become pretty well at this, okay? So I'm in trouble, actually, okay? I hope. I sit back, okay? okay? Even with one arm, because I'm close to the ground, I can hold longer. Both the press on. Even with pressure, even though he's strong, okay? By the way, notice how I'm not letting him turn me this way. It's really bad. <laughs> I'm facing him, okay? I wait for him to get a little greedy. And when he, when he, as soon as his legs pull back, that's when, that's when I go, okay? Because he's gonna push and pull Push, pull, and it's a moment I see, okay? He can't have complete tension the whole time. He has to push, push. When his legs come back, I pass. You have to be careful not to be in a triangle, right? And he knows this much. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, you can, I always like to be Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so be careful about that, right? So when I sit back, you put pressure, I wait for it to come back, and I go, okay? But don't have your head here for triangle. <laughs> it's a problem, okay? So I wait. Uh, and he put what uh, go my shoulder, and then I go uh, pass this way. Yes, yeah? this is simple, simple, simple. It works, and it's interesting because I sit like this, my head's up, and I'm facing this way. I don't want him to get me turned like this. Man. <laughs> it's like you're in a straight jacket. It's terrible. Okay, para los malucos. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, I forgot actually. <laughs> yeah, it's just like you're just like a, you can't move, okay? So imagine this. Here, hold. Oh, I sit back like this, okay? Now, also, he won't, he's not gonna tap this, but most people do, okay? I, listen, don't do that. It's su almost suicide. By the way, you can break your collarbone. It's a serious submission, okay? And I wait for someone to reach for that, okay? But I can also grab his toes, put in the hand, and I pull. Oh, yeah. sorry, sorry. Uh, no, no, no. Oh, no, it was a nice, uh, it's, no, a, no, it's no. a healthy pop. It was okay. <laughs> but you'd be surprised how many people will, they'll be freaked out, and then, then, I, then, I, then I pass, okay? So, a lot of people, I, I can make a tap with a full arm. I go, ah, with my neck, right? And they tap from there. Yeah, and guys, I can see that when, for example, when he places his hand underneath his leg, it's, there is nothing to do here against his arm. So, especially for no gi. If I had the gi, for example, if you would try to go yeah, to his own yeah. lapel, like that, but no gi, I, I, I can't see anything here. Then he can attack my foot as he showed, and uh, it's, it's cool to see that he waits for me to try to push, then when I release, that's the time that he comes. My head is up. So, just, and this is, you would teach a white belt, a, a black belt should know this, a white belt, please understand. My head is not down. When I go, my head is up with pressure like this, right? Because, of course, it's normal to think like, okay, I want to get my head here, right? But now watch. Yeah, I know. <laughs> I'm screwed, okay? So, 
in the full guard. Imagine this. I pass, my head is up, 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 up. What that? Okay? It's the same type of thing. You want your head out with posture and your chest, your weight will create pressure, okay? But if you have a head down, it's, it's not gonna work. Um, this is an example of, I call a power move. It doesn't mean it's not technical, but it means you have to be strong enough to do it, okay? So if you're not particularly strong, uh, get stronger, right? <laughs> More jiu -jitsu, you know, lift some weights. Just jiu -jitsu itself will make you strong. Strong in the weights, actually, okay? But he has me here, and I just sit, and my elbows in, okay? And I'm as close to him as possible. The more I face away, the worse he's gonna get my arm. I'm in many submissions, many trouble. Please don't do this. <laughs> it's funny, especially like MMA fighters. They're tough, good wrestlers, very tough guys. They'll try this. They'll go like this, like that. Yeah. Oh, oh man, that. I wait for that. I dream. I'm like, I hope they do that. Okay, don't do that, man. Okay. Next one. Down here. I'm gonna roll through. Usually hands up on top. He might even arm lock me. Yeah, so, yes, you know, you could roll through, but he's waiting for that. And, and with Guy, he's gonna hold my pants, you know, and I'm, he's gonna be across side, or maybe have a submission, maybe a collar choke on me, okay? One more thing, option. Now, you have to have the confidence to do this, okay? Who does this bend to me? It's my student, my, my, newly, my newly promoted black belt, Andy Burke from my school. He does this really well, it, well without Guy though, right? You have him here? He holds and he stands up right here. Like this, but both the pressure, pressure, and he just he just shakes. And comes out. Yeah, that works really well. With Guy, I wouldn't suggest this probably because he holds my belt. He's gonna hold. It's not gonna slip out that easy either. Okay. But without Guy, I would go. He does this. He stands up, and he just kind of like he shakes. His arm comes out. Okay. There's many ways out of this, of course. But uh, last one I'll show with it. I've done many times in tournaments, it's surprising, okay? But this is also a long time ago, so I don't know. My, my, my room. Right here. I have to kind of have some confidence, and I have to, uh, in wrestling, they call it a, like a limp arm. I have to make arm relaxed, and I step. I get from all, man, that's all some of you. And I've done that so many times, because it works better with no gi. With gi, your jacket is going to get caught more, okay? Can you show this one again? But, less uh, of course, no, it's good. Luck, now look, I'm gonna grab. Don't reach and stay here. I'm not saying that, okay? I'm saying I'm gonna step, my arm will go limp, and I pull out. Man, yeah, that's, that's amazing. I have to make space, step away, and turn. Same time my arm turns, it slips out, okay? Then go. That's super good. Then we'll then we'll go to the other Yeah, deep, more. I got him. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. No one expects that. No one expects that, right? <laughs> now they're in trouble. They're in my world, right? <laughs> good. Dude, thanks so much, guys. Yeah. Dean is very, very well know about his food locks and about his defense game. So to see how he escapes from Omoplan, it's one of my best positions. It was very cool to see, and it's very cool to see as well how he can approach one defense to one submission, as you just saw now. So he has this ability to get out of one horrible position and bring the guy to his best move. So that's amazing. So thanks so much. Look, pay attention, yeah. Vader. No simple sense, man. <laughs> it's not 100%, but you know, the more you practice, you get better at it, and it can work, right? Obrigado, irmão. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you.